In May of 2023, we had a day out on the Blynevin Heritage Railway in Wales. As with other heritage railways, there's quite a bit of information available on their website. And there were some prizes on the day, beyond the super nice weather. Blynevin is located southwest of Abergavenny. It's a classic coal mining area. The village and the railway span along a valley where it's possible to see aspects of its industrial past. The main facilities of the railway are west of the village. It includes a station as well as maintenance sheds and a tangle of rails that were part of the coal and steel infrastructure. A typical journey transverses lines running east and west from the station. There's an awful lot of switching and short stops here and there where people come and go. Towards the west is an uphill line that passes several water bodies, and toward the east is the Big Pit coal mine, which is now a museum. A lower line to the east runs along the edge of the valley overlooking Blynevin with a view across to the village. A typical journey will pass through the main station several times. The arrival of the engine catches everyone's attention. It's a beauty with an open cab. And the bridge at the station is a great place to view the rolling stock. The engine's from the 1860s and retains a simplicity of controls in comparison with those in other heritage lines that we have recently visited. There are also some smaller engines on the site and likely others in the sheds that we couldn't see. In addition to those of us who like to capture views out of the window, there was also a fellow doing some serious filming. He seemed to be everywhere. It's getting close to departure time. Just have to get out and have another look. Goodness, the brass is shining on this beefy. Ah, they're getting in the cab, so it looks like our journey is about to begin. And soon we reached the Black Pit Station. A few folks got off, and then we were soon on our way back.
the first of many surprises. We just passed through the main station. Oh, and the serious filming guy was there. Indeed, he would get around to another couple of passes before the end of the circuit. As we climbed along the line to the east, we passed a park with several lakes. Lots of walking. People out, enjoying the weather. We simply hadn't done our research to see that there was so much more to do. And on our return to the main station, hey, a surprise, we had an engine end change. That's always a crowd pleaser. And then we carried on west, but took the lower line toward the village. As we went along, there's actually quite a few folk out on the adjacent footpath. Everybody was waving to everybody. And we got to the end. And goodness, yes, we got another switch. So, I'm going to film this one. They really do have that ritual sort of. Back we go, into the main station, where the session terminated. We decided to walk along the footpath west to the big pit. Well worth the walk. And as we were returning, we caught up with Mr. Serious Film again, capturing yet more shots. So, end of the day, smiles all around. Where shall we go next? Remember, these heritage lines this because we get in the carriages. We help make it happen. Get a day out and see these things. <laughs>